What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's Dan here. I'd like to welcome you guys back to Detroit Become Human. We're moving on to the next chapter on the run. As you can see, we're actually using both uh, Connor and Kara on this one. So we're going to be switching between the two, possibly. So anyway, guys, hope you're ready to rock and roll with this one. If you are, be sure to hit that like button. It helps out a lot. Without any further ado, guys, let's jump into the next chapter. All right, we gotta we gotta look different. We gotta cut our hair, change clothes, mainly because we gotta blend it. We gotta get rid of our thing, our little brain thing, whatever you call that. You think it's a good idea to leave her in there? I guess we're not gonna go far. Check the neighborhood. What's in here? Crowbar. Change appearance, okay, so definitely that's top priority. What do we got here? Some scissors. She's just gonna cut the ponytail off. Most girls, this would be absolutely, like, atrocious. Blasphemy. There you go. Now she's wrapping... She's actually kind of cute. I don't I don't like short hair, personally. Um, but that's not too bad. I don't mind that. So we can pick a color. That's cool. All right. What are we thinking? Blonde, white, black. We got to change the color. I'm thinking... Let's go white, I think. We could probably choose more than that. Oh, God. That's cool. Oh wait, actually, maybe not. Let's try blonde. So we can cycle between them and see which one we like the best. Let's see what black looks like. So brown was the default, right? Yeah, that was the default. See blonde again? I like the blonde, let's take the blonde. And now you gotta get rid of this. But now you can't do any of that cool stuff anymore. Normally she wouldn't be able to do that, but because she broke through her wall. All right, she's back in action. What do we got here? We gotta find new clothes. Ones that don't smell of piss. Crowbar. There's a crowbar on the ground. Before I do that, though, what's this? Death to androids. How lovely. Oh, dear. Someone killed his ass. All right, let's go. Wait, wait. Hold on. What do we got? I guarantee you there's some clothes in the trunk. But I worry it's going to wake up Alice. That's my concern here. Apparently it didn't. Well, ain't that... And it's a, it's a girl's coat, right? I remember uh, in Heavy Rain, the animations for clothes were absolutely hilarious. All right, now what's up? Can we go looking around still? This is st this is still cracked, so All right, as long as she'll be okay, that's all I really care about. Police patrolling the area. They're looking for her. Oh wait, what's that? 
What's on the ground here? Oh, it's a magazine or something. Wildlife. Canada still Android free zone. Where the air is clean and clean and welcome is always warm. So we don't have androids yet, apparently, at this time. But it's beautiful, isn't it? That's the land. Home and native land, baby. There. Oh, look! They actually have my city on there. See that? They've actually marked Edmonton in Alberta there. Middle one. Awesome. Still Android free. Despite the United States voting in its Android Act, as early as 2028, the Canadian Parliament is yet... I can't really read it. Androids are still not sold in Canada and have no official status in the country. So that's one way they can go. Oh, whoops. I didn't want to do that. So it's come up. We'll welcome you. You just got to get past the borders. The border patrol. Continuing to fuel unprecedented growth in the U.S. economy. Yet contributing to record levels. Against putting them on sale. Canada remains an end. Okay. It might, like, we always get things a million years later than the United States anyway. That's one thing that we that I can tell you. In Canada, what's things that we get, you guys have had for in the States for, like, ever. And they're like, wow, you just got it? We're like, yes, we did. It's kind of frustrating. But, hey, we don't have Android debts. Got them. We have Tim Hortons and polar bears. Well, not, <laughs> not really. <laughs> Only up north. Super north. I've never seen a polar bear in my life. Can we do it gently? Alice. Wake up, Alice. Sorry. Dude. So it wasn't a nightmare. No. No, it wasn't a nightmare. How do you feel? I'm cold. It said you were warm. That's a lie. What are we going to do now? That android we saw yesterday, he gave me an address. He said we could get help there. The train passes just on the other side of the road. The station can't be far. You feel okay to walk a little? Let's go then. All right, let's bounce. You're pretty like that. You really look like a human now. Not that I didn't before. It's just the chip. What were you doing back there with that little girl? Uh, we, we just, we saw, we saw a butterfly. In this rain? Sure. Was he still there? Oh, it's the lieutenant. Police are on our trail. Alright. That's all for now. Are we tapping? Are we tagging into the, uh, like, you know, Connor? We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, well, let me know if they turn anything up. What are you going to do with that? I have no idea. All right, Hank is... Oh, no. I think that means your relationship it to them. the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Maybe. Here's the thing, maybe I can find it. Like maybe I can, you know, be be him and find him, find her. Oh god, so we're not we're not playing as Connor yet. Got to make it to the train station without danger level, sneak past the cops. Is there other options? Yes, very good danger level. Let's go. Let's go around this way. Sixty-four percent. Fifty-two. 
How am I gonna get past that cop? Let's cross the street. It won't let me. There's gotta be a better route. We still good? Go, what are you doing? Go! Go! Oh my gosh. Don't mean to alarm you, but there were cops there. Just want to make sure no one's here. We're on the right track. Keep it going. Ooh. Holy hell, that was close. 99%. <laughs> Cross the street. Let's go. This is intense. It's so intense, we're camping, bro. Oh, crap. Start sweeping. I'll take the umbrella. Oh, my flipping God. Hold it. God, this isn't... Oh, my God. I can't. It's, it's wild. These cops keep coming out of nowhere. But we got to avoid them. I see my next dip. Right over here, right? Quick, start entering digits. You're taking out cash. Woo! This is awesome, guys. Because if I mess up, if I let go at any given time. It, it messes everything up. He didn't see anything. It won't get far. We'll find it sooner or later. Now it's my turn, let me guess, to question stuff? As Connor? I don't know. Wow, we made it. Are you okay? See, what happened to her mom in all this? We know she ran away, but... Why, what kind of mother does that? Just leaves her daughter with a man like that? Unless she was worse than him. We don't know that. I mean, it's super rare for the, the dad to get custody, but maybe mom didn't want her either, which makes it even sadder. 20% completed, hey? What did we miss? Okay, let me see. Wait a minute, there's this whole section. Like a whole section we skipped out on. You know why? We were, we were in a different location. I'll bet if we were here, see the one in the middle? The middle one was probably if we stayed in the house and then it met up there. And then one of them was in the motel. This one goes all the way down. Holy hell, look at this. Three different endings. That is wild. So I guarantee you this one here, the bottom one, because of all the actions, was because of the motel. People would be sweeping the area. The discreet one, see how easy it was? We skipped out a bunch of possibilities. That's really cool. We managed to get away. We did the simple one. That's insane. So I'll bet you if we hadn't done that, we got caught or something, we'd have to be Connor and be interviewed. That is super cool, man. Makes me want to try the other the, the other possibilities. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this chapter on the run. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to hit that like button. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you haven't yet, be sure to like and follow my pages on social media, facebook.com slash DanQ8000 for live streams and other content. Twitter, DanQ8000. Instagram, danq 8 And Snapchat, danq 8000 If you want to get yourself a shirt or a hoodie, there's a link to my shop in the description below. If you want to say 10% of your next DX Racer, link in the description. Be sure to use the promo code DanQ8000 at checkout. All right, guys, thank you so much again. Take it easy. You have a wonderful day. I'll be seeing you soon for more content. But until then, let's have things over to Knox Hill. Have a good one, guys. Who's the man with the plan? Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violent and hit you. 8,000. Wait a minute, hold that stylist style. Dan. Goddamn, Billy Jack. We still riding tires flat. I hear them sirens, sea shots flying. So we driving fire back. If they ain't vibing, lie with that. Got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up, and I see them haters. Try to run with us, they don't need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard just like the beta players. Grab your respirators. Night invaders get lightsabered.
Mass on for the shooters, move like trash to bed intruder. Got that Glock and got them woofers. Just press play, I'll keep it moving. Who is knock? Still, you damn fools. Keep it fresh like canned food. There ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn kill. Yeah. It was never, ever a game.